Hi, I'm Shoot Shurogawa, and uh, thank you for purchasing this DVD and also Phantasma Linking Ring. Uh, this is my friend Tanisha. Hello. Uh, well, today I want to show this linking ring for you. But have you here this uh, linking ring, Chinese linking ring? I have it. Uh, it's a really historical old linking ring trick from China. And I'm from Japan, I don't know why I'm doing this. But wow, I... your English is really good. <laughs> your English is very good too. <laughs> <laughs> All right. <laughs> what is this? Oh, oh. Uh, well, this uh, uh, I'm honored to won uh, the uh, called Magician of the Year from Magic Castle Academy of Magical Arts. And then um, actually, but this is the reason that I got this one because you know I performed this magic for the, all over the world and people liked it. That's why you know I got this award. Wow! Yeah, but uh, I'm sure I'm gonna share this secret and also this performance for you. So I hope you enjoy this moment together. Okay. Okay, Tanisha, I would like to show linking ring. But uh, first of all, could you examine this one? This is uh, a solid ring, beautiful ring, mm -hmm. and I would like to do this. But uh, if it's only one, it doesn't work. So that's why I have uh, four of them, okay? okay? One, two, three, four. And I would like to do one and one, so which means two rings. Uh, watch careful when I do like this way, of course, it's solid rings. But when I do like this, now it's link, okay? Not just that, watch careful when I toss like this way, link too. Do you want to oh examine this? Okay, thank you so much. That's really. Uh, I'm kidding. You can examine this one. It's a link, right? So now you can try to pull. Oh, mine doesn't work. Also, it's really hard. Huh. So this is the key. If I want to do, just draw it like this way. You got it? Oh. Oh, what's wrong with this? Oh, let me see. Uh, I can do it like this way. When I do it like this, for example, like this. Right, three. One, two, three rings together. And last one gonna be here. And now four rings. You can feel that like this way, okay? But uh, let's see what I can do now. Okay, it's so four rings together, but now it's stuck all together. Now, are you doing this? one by one, one by one, watch careful. Uh, for example, when I do like this way, it come off from here, like this. Okay, second one, like this way. Third one, fourth one. It looks like linking, right? When you see from side, it's linking. But if you see from side, like this way, no <laughs> so uh, it's a full linking ring. I uh, hope you enjoyed it. Thank you so much. Thank you. All right. So now I'd like to explain about this trick. Are you ready? Definitely. Okay. Very good. So uh, this is four rings, and every ring is different. For example, first ring is a solid ring called single ring. Single. Okay. And also this one called double ring. Double ring means that it's linking from beginning to the end. It's permanently linked. So ah. you know from beginning to the end, it never come off. Okay? Now I see. Okay, that's kind of interesting. <laughs> but also I use called key ring. Key ring is like this. Uh, the, this gap here for the, this ring. Oh. This is a secret. And also this is a key, exact key for the, this trick. Okay? This is a situation. I have to hold these rings in order. Uh -huh. So first of all, I hold key ring in my hand. Of course, gaff is gonna be in. If it's out, it's no good. People are gonna see secret. In your hand, double ring, single ring. This is order, okay. okay? And first of all, I take this single ring and pass for the spectator, uh -huh. or you, or who else, wherever you like, and show for the ring. I would like this ring over here, and you know, this is a solid ring, and I would like this four of them. When I say that, I hold my hand, palm up, okay, uh -huh. and I drop from right hand to left hand one by one. One, two, three. But last one is a key ring, so don't drop like this way because people are gonna see. So last one is gonna be just lightly put in the hand. Uh -huh. Okay, one more time. One, two, three, and four. Then take key ring in your right hand. Take key ring in your right hand, and also you can take double ring in your hand. Look. It's a single and double. I switched the double in the hand first and take single ring. Okay? Key and single. If you confuse a little bit, after you do count, you put three of them and take only one. It's also easy to do. Okay? This is what I have to do. This is a key ring. You have to hold the ring in your hand, but this is what I have to do. Three fingers, pinky, third finger, and middle finger, are gonna close around here. Okay? And first ring and thumb gonna pinch here okay basically always we have flexibility on the thumb and the first finger okay mm -hmm. so now you can see this ring also this is of course sing single ring so we cannot pass this ring but you can pass this ring also right the, this way okay. so watch first ring and thumb 
passing some looks exact same looks and we cross like this way of course it never happened anything but if we open this space just a little bit tiny bit of course you can see but if this goes through here the cross if I do over action like this way oh. or like this way you know if it's close of course it's gonna link but it must be secret so we kind of rub like this way once and cross oh. once did you see that right now and link this is the first thing Okay, and uh, if you finish like this and stop here, people are gonna ask me, oh, okay, I wanna see your ring. So it's really risky, you know, people are gonna take this ring. So same time, you take double ring, mm -hmm. pause and catch and drop one. As you know, it's linked from beginning. So, you know, the people surprise, but uh, we don't surprise at all. So when I toss like this, link like this way and pass for the audience. Of course, they can examine this one. It never you know, unlinks. This is what yeah, of course, yep. <laughs> so, and uh, you try to uh, unlink, mm -hmm. yep. This is like a fun path, you know, if they try to unlink. And then when you're doing this, mm -hmm. if I link, I unlink really quick, people gonna ask, okay, I wanna see your ring, mm -hmm. right? That's why when you try to unlink, I also have a problem together. Oh, mine doesn't work. <laughs> and oh, how about this? We're gonna do it together. So we hold like this way, and look. When I did this, I did unlink again. Whichever you like, you can go through like this. So it's an unlink, but don't do it like this, okay? When you do unlink, stay here. It looks like linking, right? Looks like linking, can you see it? Mm -hmm. Looks like linking, but of course it's not linking. So what we do is, uh, could you hold like this? They don't know it's unlinked, so could you blow it? And then I do unlink. Of course they can, of course it's a you know, double link. But like almost same time we make happen. They're, oh, why you, you guys don't work? And Put this ring on the hand, take this double ring and key ring together. And do exact same move, key ring here, double ring here, just link here, make three rings link together. Okay? So now it's a kind of big part of this routine because this ring is gonna link over here, this is situation, but if I do like this way, it's boring because we did it many times. That's why we tap here, look, this looks like. That's fancy. Ah, close map. Okay, mm. uh, but if I do like this way, it's you know looks fancy. But this is what I'm doing. I touch here, just touching here, but it's nothing. Touch, touch, touch. And when it comes front of this key ring, link from here and go through. Hey, it looks beautiful. Now it's a straight four link, four rings link together. So now it's a single and double. Okay, now you have to turn over this ring like this way. Okay. And then, now double ring is outside, single ring is inside, it's opposite. Take this ring and link from here, it's basic. Okay, now it's stuck together. It was a straight and this ring goes through here, but of course it must uh, go smooth. So now one, two, three rings together. And turn over again, can you see it? Like this way. I did just do this. So now single and double. Take single ring, okay, and I did this like this way, like this. Okay, this is the exact basic move. But you know, if you want to, you can make them hold. Could you hold here and just like this way? It's more experience. You know, they're gonna react better. But you know, just I'm doing unlink one, okay, and take one ring and two rings here. This is double, right? Mm -hmm. So now, if you want to unlink one more, you have to stack three rings together. Can you see? Single and double together and all three rings can see one two three rings gonna go through from here to other side like this way now it's switch the single and double you know what i'm saying mm -hmm. it is a one two hold it together three rings go through from front to the back so now looks like second rings come out from here okay now you i can see your question mark on your head Okay, what is that? Okay, it's a little strange. But if I try to take off like this and like this, it's like a too much, you know, I took off two, it's too much. That's why I have to pretend, you know, I took one, I take second one, looks like, but all stuck together and go through from front to the back, come off, just try it later, you know, yourself. <laughs> and then last one, same thing, I do unlink. If you want to, you can do this presentation, or if you want to, you look people, and move really slow and come off. It's the exact same thing but looks different. So if you want to, you can do. If you want to, you can do. 
different way. But it's uh, the routine, basic routine. I hope you understand this, but I know maybe you feel a little bit difficult, but I, ho I hope you can enjoy this one. Thank Aww, you so much. It's magic. Okay, now I would like to show you more detail, so you're gonna see more close-up shot. So I'm gonna use key ring and single ring, watch careful. Okay, I hold this key ring with three finger and first finger and thumb like this way. And also left hand is holding single ring, which is the exact same looks with the right hand, which means a key ring and single is, looks like a mirror. Okay, so this is what I want to do. Thumb and first finger is, must be flexible. Okay, and also this ring is gonna link from you know, back side to the front or front side to the back side. But I will show you the basic one back side to the front, okay? If you see from back, you can tell this is a point. Okay, this is a single. This ring goes through from back to the front and link like this way. But if we do this, people can see secret. That's why we close here, okay? And this is what I do. Thumb is a little bit soft and open a little bit, just tiny bit, not like this way. Just a little, like that much, okay? And this one goes through here. And after it come here, close my thumb, and first finger become relaxed, and then move on like this way. So, when you do it, you can do it again. If you hold the single ring, like this way, and if it go from back side again, thumb relax, open, thumb close, first finger open. Now unlink. You can do link and unlink both sides, okay? If you do the opposite side, you can do also the same thing. You open first finger just a little bit. Don't open like that much. It flash. So that's why I open like just a little bit. Go through here. And go through here. But when you do this, you know, don't do this like this way because people are going to see here because it link from there. That's why we want to do like this. When we link from thumb to the first finger side, we don't link right away. We rub a little bit and link like this way. Or when you do unlink, when you do unlink, don't look like this way. So when you do it, rub a little bit and unlink from looks like here. So this is like an idea. But basically if you see from front, it looks like the exact same and rub it and link. And then if you want to, you can do it again and unlink from there. So this is an idea and also I hope you understand and play really well. Okay, now I would like to show you the detail of like all rings linked together straight up and also the one by one individually separate one by one from key ring. Watch careful, okay? So uh, first of all, double ring and key rings here, it link as basic, three. Last one from here, and looks like link from bottom, but actually link from here, like this way, it becomes straight. From this, a little bit difficult to watch, okay? Now, single and double. Double ring is the hand side, right hand side. Single ring is outside, right? So we have to turn over this key ring to this way okay now double ring is outside single ring is uh, inside so watch this double ring here and it one link from here which is a basic link from here just only one ring this double ring one double ring gonna link like this way okay now it's stuck together double outside single inside it's the same so now you have to turn over again okay so now single and double okay now uh, you take a single ring. For example, if I decide this ring gonna go through here from back side to the front side, I take single ring. Now, when I do basic move here, as you know, it come off from back to the front. It come off once. And second one is really confused. So watch careful. Single and double. This is what we have to do. You know, we put three rings together. Okay? Can you see this ring is together? When I do this, this double rings come off from here, but same time, this key single ring is going to link here, So, which means if I do separate, I take off this one and I put this one. This is what I'm doing, but it's tricky, so I will try it again. So now, first one come off and take one, and this double ring together, three. So double ring come off from here, look, and also the single ring goes through. If it's all one move, one and two. Now, looks like second rings come off from here, okay? And third one, fourth one, it's basic. Just unlink from here, which you really like, and four rings separate. Looks like one by one come off from key ring. That's the point. So I hope you understand what I'm talking about.
All right, so uh, I'd like to show you a uh, linking ring routine again. Are you mm -hmm. ready to see? Yeah, good luck though, because I already know the secret. Oh, okay. That's really <laughs> hard for me, but I'm sure you're going to enjoy it a little bit different way. Okay. So I, I use the same thing. I hit like this way, a little bit different. Because after I tap like this way, you can see these rings in your hand. Huh. Very good. Okay, watch careful. I tap like this way here, same thing, tap here and here, just I tap like this way and when I do like this, it links from here, okay? So oh. now, 22, you can see it's a kind of classic linking ring, okay? And you already studied some, maybe, maybe not, it's four rings together, okay? So now I need a hand like this, okay? okay? This is what I'm gonna do, I do like this way and hold bottom mm -hmm. and just like this and pull down like this way and now oh. we come up from there, okay? Last one and second one from here, okay? Like this, same thing. The last one is gonna be a little bit special because you know you can say stop wherever you like. It. Say stop. Stop. Okay, okay. That's fast. <laughs> oh wow, it's hard. This position. This is what I'm gonna do. I tap like this way, and you can see from front and back. You can come off from there. This is a linking ring routine. I thought I knew. I hope you enjoyed it. <laughs> Okay, now I would like to explain intermediate routine. Okay, okay. so uh, I would like to explain to you. Uh, basic knowledge is the same as basic, but I will explain fast, okay? This is called key ring, one solid ring. This is called double ring, which is uh, linked from beginning to the end, as you know. Mm -hmm. And this is uh, also key ring, which is uh, having gap like this way. Okay, and we have all that to hold in my hand, in your hand, key ring, double ring, and single ring. It's the same as basic, same I order? guess. Same order? Same order, okay. yes. And then uh, this is what I do. Basically, like a false count, one, two, three, four. Just I drop one by one. Last one should be careful because it's gonna flash. So I put like this way. Okay, one, two, three, four. And now it's gonna be a little bit advanced, right? So I hold three rings, but I hold this double ring only one to the on the fingertip. Mm -hmm. Okay, it's a little bit separate from other two. And I'm ready to drop one like this way. Be ready to drop. And I use key ring to hit here, one, two, three. When I tap three times, I drop this ring. One, two, three, and drop this one. But same time, this ring go to the front, like this way. If I do this, looks like link. Can you see it? When I do like this way, you can see from side, right? Can you see from side? One, two, three, look. It looks like link. Oh, yeah. So it seems like I link one, two. So you're two. just holding it yep. there. I'm holding like this, and I drop one, and pass the, everything on the right hand and pass for the spectator. Of course, they're going to examine, okay. same as you did. You know, people are going to do it like this way. It's a fun moment. <laughs> so this is the first part. But second one is a little bit different. Look, uh, I originally used the key ring to the first finger side. First finger and thumb hold the key, and three finger hold this ring, right? Mm -hmm. It was the original idea. If you want to know about this detail, you go back to the uh, basic one. But now I hold this key ring to the pinky side, okay? So this is the pinky side here. But of course, if you hold like this, you can see this gap. Mm -hmm. So that's why I'm gonna close like this way. Okay? Okay. And this is a link. And do you remember I did this one? It looks really magical, isn't it? Mm hmm So when you get better, you can link from here, from here. Wait, like how did you do that? Yeah, that's a good question. That's <laughs> what I'm gonna teach you. So basically, when I hit this ring, this ring is holding like this, like kind of, you know, the 90 degree from ground. Mm -hmm. And then this ring hit from top. Okay, when I hit here, this ring is pointing like axis, so when I hit here, it slides in oh. and come back. Technically linking from T again. So this is a basic knowledge. I will show you later, but when I do this, it looks like linking from here. And people are surprised, of course. Then I take spectator's link, ring. So same time, I move this key ring to the first finger side. Again, same position as basic. And link from here. Wow, that's easy now, yeah. <laughs> because you know, that we used many times. One more time, I link this double ring from here, so now it's all stuck together. Now, it's experience, you know, if you see magic just far away, mm -hmm. you don't feel it's real, but if you touch, you're gonna feel real, right? Yeah. So this is what I do. Double ring, single ring is this. Single ring is inside, of hand side, so I turn over once, and now I make them, make you hold like, could you hold your hand like this way? Mm -hmm. Very good, I use the audience hand, and the single, and double ring, only one double ring. One single, one double ring, take off from here, right? Mm -hmm. So when I take off from here, now it's gonna be like this. 
because then only single and one double gonna go through. Uh-huh. And when it come down, could you hold the bottom one? And now look, it's already separate, but I hold together. It looks like it's together. Ah. Could you hold a little bit lower? Very mm-hmm. good. So look, it looks like straight up one, two, three, four link together, and then looks like a link, ah. and you feel like kind of vibration, right? Yeah. Oh. You're very surprised. Yeah, this experience <laughs> is very powerful. First one gonna unlink and uh, very surprised and go second one. Second one is a little bit advanced, okay? You know, I have to do this single and double ring go through key together. This is what I want to do, but if you do this, it doesn't make people surprised. So I take this ring with two finger, okay, third finger and pinky, mm-hmm. okay, and then hold this one double ring and key ring together. This one goes through like a double ring come off. Same time, key ring goes, a uh, single ring goes through here. So it looks like I'm taking this ring, but actually I hold this two ring goes through here. And then when I do like this way, looks like it come off from here. Ah, That's so you do a little pull to Yes, to it looks like, yeah, like, yeah, look like, you know, it come off here, but okay. actually I switch over here. That's mm-hmm. the truth. This is an illusion. Yeah. Then I take this one. This is the second part. But last one is again a little advanced, so you know this is what I do. Okay, this key ring go to the pinky side again. If you want to, you can use your thumb to rotate a little bit, or if you want to, you can use your other hand to rotate like this way. Right now it's gonna be the pinky side again. So you hold rings, and I hold here. This is what I do: one, two, and three. It's a little bit ah. tricky. Okay, just don't. Uh, I don't have to use this one. Hold like this. Palm down. Okay, my left hand is palming down, tap, tap, and palm up, and unlink from pinky side here. Unlink, but if I do like this, it looks like it come off from here. That's why I come off, take off from here, forward. So, if you see from side, like this way, one, two, and three. So, if you want to, I can show you a little bit. This unique way, you know, you cannot do for the audience, but you know, if it's not my hand, you can understand. Could you hold like this? Like this, very good. And palm down. Same thing, mm-hmm. and palm up, and slide like this Flip way. Flip it around. Yes. Oh. So, but it looks like it come off from here. Mm-hmm. So, you know, then when I performed, I said say stop, and they say stop. But if you want to, you know, looks like I ending from here or here, but how about this? I can use here, you can say that. I can take off from here, watch. One, two, palm oh. up, and three. And come off. That was the stop. Yes, that's uh, like another, oh. you know, that you can substitute. But uh, it's uh, like an idea, so, you know, it looks like ending from part of them far from hand but this is like a, you know how to approach but this is like a, a kind of an intermediate routine so i hope you enjoy it thank you so much yes okay uh, i would like to show more detail so uh, you can see more close up shot okay basically key ring is here and you close your hand like this way and I will show you the link from there. But if you practice, you know, you have a lot of good advice. For example, this. You know, the, the position is very important. When you hold key ring, a pinky side, you are not sure how deep is this, how shallow is this. You don't know about this, but if you have a playing card or business card or any paper card, put right here. Look, if this card is straight like this way, it's a perfect position, okay? And if this card is bending like this, you're gonna hit and you're gonna hit pinky, so get pain. Be careful, you have to be very careful to get pain. So just straight card is good. Don't drop card, if you drop card, audience is seeing this secret. Hold card straight and hold card ring like this way. Hit straight down and this ring gonna slide in like this way, okay? Now I would like to show you from side. Can you see it? Like this way. Okay, this is the process. Key ring here, single ring bottom. We hit here, this ring goes through like this way. Don't try to hit here. Again, when you hit here, you're gonna get pain at the pinky or you know, just you know, cut your finger yourself. That's no good, you must be very careful. That's why you need to have, find a good position and also you need to practice really slow. And also you should have a playing card here. It's very easy to start, okay? Hold like this, always cut it straight. Single ring is here. Don't point here, don't point other, just always this single ring is pointing to the axis at the center point of the ring, key ring. One, two, three, when you hit here, it's gonna slide in like this way and come back like this. 
if you do smooth, looks like this. Okay, so if you have a cut, it's gonna be smooth. Okay, don't hit too hard. Always do slow, and then try to hit like a just a little bit. Don't hit too much. This is a basic idea, basic technique called crash link. But also, I will teach you one more, like you know how to unlink from here. So watch careful when I do this. I hold rings. Don't hold rings strange way. Always hold rings like this and this bottom ring, which is a single key. Single ring is a 90 degree from a key ring. So you hold like this. It's very natural position, right? When you see from front, it's natural position. Always hold natural and palm down, hit here, and palm up. Now, the pinky side and pinky side is crossing each other and pull this way. Now this rings unlink from here and go forward. Okay, if you see like this, it's funny, but you can see a little bit detail. Tap, tap, keys here, one, two. When it come over like this way, unlink from there and come off. So now you can see from back. Can you see it from here? Tap, tap, palm up, unlink from here and go forward like this way. So this is like an unlink. These two things are you know, only two movements we are using pinky side of holding position by key ring. Key ring is always fast finger side, but only these two movements, you have to use pinky. That's it. So please be careful to practice, but it's a really beautiful move. I hope you enjoy it. Okay, so uh, this is also detail about the one move because it's a little bit complicated. So now, cross up shot, very easy to watch. Single ring and double ring is here. Key ring is right here. I'm holding three finger and thumb and first finger. Same as always. Watch. Uh, now, I want to make it straight, looks like, and come off from bottom. That's what I want to do. First of all, take single and one double. Not everything. Single and one double. And these two going to come off from here and make straight, of course. And then, if you want to, you can do just yourself. But if audience hold it, Looks like it come off from there. And they feel this movement, that's good things. But the second one is gonna be very difficult. Okay, now, I use this ring and this ring. This, you know, this is a double ring, but you know, only one double ring. I'm gonna hold these two together. But when I do this, I want to hold this one as, with pinky and side finger, but it's separate, watch. When I hold this, don't make all things together. It's wrong, this is not right, okay? Hold this ring with third finger and middle finger and then just hold this double ring and single ring only one double and one single second double is right here this one this one is no moving okay so these two gonna go through key ring like this one two rings go through here so double one of the double ring come off key ring, single ring come off uh, come in so it looks like come off from here Let's try it again from back, okay? From here, you take this ring with third finger, okay? And only the use first double ring and the single ring here. So you can see this is separate, this is separate. So here, I take off this one, two rings, looks like come off from here. So this is a technique of separation. It's a little bit complicated, but if you practice really well, it's gonna be smooth. So it looks like one by one come off from bottom, but I hope you understand how I, I do it, and I hope you perform for the people. Thank you so much. Okay, uh, I would like to share something different from uh, linking ring routine. Uh, I'm gonna okay. ring, could you examine this one? And also just I would like this, yes, just only one. Uh, and also I would like this rope here. Uh, also, could you examine this one? Mm -hmm. Okay. And also I would like this handkerchief I brought from someone. Okay. This is also a regular handkerchief. Okay. okay. So everything is pretty simple. Mm -hmm. But like if I use everything what I have, maybe people don't trust that. That's why I want to use something from you. Uh, for example, your finger ring. That maybe looks special. So I would like to borrow your ring. Uh -huh. Can I borrow it? I trust you. Uh, yeah, you can trust me, but I don't trust All me myself. Right. But you can I'm take off you. and you can put over here. <laughs> okay, this is what I want to do. I would like to hold rope like this way. Okay. okay. And then, you know, I put this rope here. So I like to go through this rope over here. So ah. look. Now, could you hold in? No. So could you pull? 
Okay, now it's really tight, right? Mm -hmm. so this is what I want to do. I want to put this ring, finger ring, in the rope like this way. Okay, really slowly I'm moving. Okay. So when I do like this way. So when I put this ring here, uh, can you see it? Mm -hmm. It's in. So if I want to take off this ring, I must to take off this ring from this side. So which means that if you hold this end, I cannot do anything. Could you hold this end for me? Mm -hmm. So now it's really uh, in a situation and you know it doesn't come off. Okay. And I put this handkerchief over here. So, uh, but I would like to this ring. This is only one ring you have, right? Mm -hmm. Okay, it's a very special ring, I guess. But uh, oh, yeah. Uh, yeah. And is this made by gold or something? Yes. Oh, really? Wow, that's expensive. Diamonds so, too. Okay. Oh, ooh, ooh, wow. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> but uh, you know, if it's a diamond and gold ring, it's very expensive. I don't want to lose it. But like, you know, if it's a metal is gold, it's a really soft metal. Right. So which means then, if I want, to, I can take off from this rope. But it's a little bit hard. Let me see. Uh, okay, watch careful. This is what I want to do. Like this way, so now <gasps> ring is gone. Like this way, it's very interesting because you know, when you see it, it looks like gone, but actually ring is right here. Yeah, <sighs> it, this ring is nice on me, Thank I guess. God. But uh, anyway, yeah, this is your ring. Oh. Yes, okay. Yes. And you can examine uh. everything. Thank you so much. I hope you liked it. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs>
that's why and I'm then sweating. We show, yeah, we show the finger ring like this, or you know, we can pretend I don't wear the ring, and you know, we wait till they find the finger ring. So only problem if you perform this one, maybe one of the hardest part is you know the time. How long are you gonna take time for this? Maybe 10 seconds, one minute. So maybe if you want to, when you put the handkerchief, you need to talk. Just make some of you know like a you know, good conversation. Is this is this like a for example gold or like a for example king or for example whatever you like you know? Or well, is this diamond ring or is this expensive or for example where did you get this one? So if we have this kind of conversation, you have enough time to take off ring and put finger ring on on the fingertip and put everything on the back. <sighs> I'm done. Oh, by the way, when it's not finger, hmm, done. So you know, you need the time to do this. This is very important. But if you understand this one, this is one wow, beautiful, simple trick. So I hope you perform this magic for someone in the future. There we go. Thank you so much. Okay, I would like to share something, uh, you know, special for you. Okay, Even more is, special than the last ones? Yes, uh, this is my signature piece called Ninja Ring. Like a ninja, wow. That's cool. <laughs> but uh, I hope you like it. It's really quick and I hope you enjoy all together. I use the table and make spin like this. Ooh. And like this one. Okay, watch careful right here. This way. Okay, one more time. Wow. I toss ring and tap link. Watch. Oh wow. Straight on the table. One, two, three. Three and one. Two and two. And one and one. And listen careful. It's noisy, but quiet. Silent. <laughs> I know. <laughs> I'm good, thank you. But uh, well, it's gonna be straight and it's gonna be one hand. Watch, just like this. One, two, three. One hand, like this. So, it's a simple trick. If you like it, it is a good puzzle. And if you don't like it, it's just a trick. But if you really love it, it's gonna be beautiful magic called ninja ring. I mean, Chinese linking ring. I hope you liked it. Ah, oh, I see you so why much. you call it ninja. Thank you. Okay, this is a really simple but fancy trick. Do you okay. like rope trick? Sure. Sure, which means that rope is not <laughs> enough. That's why I do something different. I use rope and I make like a knot over here, like this way. It's no secret knot, okay? Mm -hmm. Watch careful. I count three. One, two, three, like this. So, silk appear in the middle of the rope. Where'd that come from? Uh, uh, I don't know. But uh, it's a nice Magic. trick. I hope you liked it. Thank you so much. <laughs> Right. Uh, this is a very simple trick. I'm sure okay. you can do it, so I want to explain to you. Okay. okay. Uh, basically, I use one handkerchief and one rope. Okay. And uh, you know, we put rope like this, and we make knot. But no, don't make knot of rope. Actually, we make knot over here with handkerchief, like this. So this handkerchief is stuck in here, and it's gonna move right, to left, like this way. Maybe you can make it a little bit tighter. Okay. So this is what I do. I hold this knot in the hand mm -hmm. and then all handkerchief gonna be in the hand this is silk handkerchief so when I open the hand it appear oh my god it's <laughs> <That's> really <laughs> yes I know <laughs> you make it special so uh, you know I hold everything like this in my hand you know for example if you are right handed hold it in your right hand like this way okay and then move to the end of rope and hold the other end of rope like this way Okay, very beginning, you stand like this way, you drop one end of rope, never drop other side because the silk appear. Mm -hmm. So now what I do is I hold two ends and make knot on the top like this way. Okay, maybe we can make a little bit, you know, the smaller smaller knot like this way. Mm -hmm. Okay, hold this end, this end together. This is what I do. I pinch here, okay, and I open my hand. Same time, I make knot like this way, so this silk appear in the middle of rope. It's really quick, really quick. But uh -huh. if you do, uh, if you do slow, sometimes it makes really tight, really like you know, mm -hmm. uh, like a wrinkle. But I know if you <laughs> really quick, yes, it's gonna be really fancy. <laughs> so this is what I do again. Okay, I hold everything. I hold everything like this way. When you open, appear. 
So that's very important. I like that. Yes. Yeah. I hope it, yeah. <laughs> and there's also special sound effect. That's great. <laughs> so uh, we hold N and N like this way, two in, two ends. We make a knot and just we roll. One, two, three. Third time, drop and silk up here. Beautiful silk production. But you know, if you do this for the party, maybe people are going to surprise a lot. So I hope you perform for someone. I love that. Thank you so much. <laughs> Okay, that's all. Thank you so much, Anisha. Did you enjoy and uh, did you study something? Yes. Very look. Good. All right, that's a uh, link from beginning, but uh, it's a nice job. Yeah, yeah, you can do something <laughs> like that, but you know, I'm sure you know, that it's a possibility of you know, oral people, but I hope you enjoy it and I hope you perform for the people. But of course, if you have some question or like if you're interested in magic, come to the www.phantasmamagic.com. You can see a lot of different things too. But I, I hope I can see you in the future. Thank you so much. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.